Hi, this is Nico and welcome back to Floor Planner. This is lesson two of our tutorial series in which we will add doors, windows and stairs. The plan that you are looking at right now is a simple house and we're drawing this plan step by step. Last time we made the wall layout. Let's start with adding doors. Go to the build section with this icon and down below here in the sidebar you find our collection of doors. This is going to be our hallway. So I'd like a front door in this wall and the front door is over here. Click and drag it in and you can see that it'll snap to the closest wall section. Just release to drop it on the wall. If we take a look at our 3D image, you can see that the door is cut off as high as our wall section. This is to get a better view of the room sizes. You can set the section height in your settings. I'd like to have classic panel doors on my inner walls. That's this one. I'm placing one over here to give access to the living room. And now I click it and press the duplicate icon and then I move my mouse to this wall and click again and now I have a door that gives access to the toilet area. Click the door again and it has to open to the outside so I'm pressing this icon to flip it and let's duplicate this door again and place one over here so you can actually open the indoor closet. Let's click it again, flip the hinge side and notice that in the sidebar you can set the size of your door. Actually I just want to have this door a bit smaller like this so it will fit the wall. Finally let's have a French door in this wall that will open to our garden area. We have a modern French door and a more classic one. I'd like the more classic version. Let's continue with the windows. Click back in the sidebar and choose windows. Let's start with a simple window in this wall section. Just click and drag and release. And if you click again, let's set the width to 90 and duplicate this window to the other side of the alcove. And we're almost done with the bay window. I just want a three pane window in this wall section. That's this one. Voila. Um, now I'd like another window in this wall section. Just drag and drop and release. Let's check out the 3D view. And there you go. A nice bay window and a two pane window. Let's go back and let's have a look at the structures section. Um, we have a set of ready-made architectural objects to help you quickly create your floor plan. Among these we have all kinds of stairs, there are fireplaces, radiators, uh, several columns and pillars, elevators, balconies and railings for balconies, fuse boxes and even more. Let me try out some stairs. Let's take a straight one. This one would do. We could also use a winding staircase. But this one won't fit, so let me remove it. Um, and there's a U-shaped staircase. This one, that's another option. Let's remove this one. As you can see this stair overlaps with the door, but I'd like to know if the door can still open below the staircase. So let's take a look at the door height. This is 220 centimeters. Let's set the wall section height to 230. And let's go to the 3D mode. And as you can see, you can still open the door to the toilet, even though there's a staircase above it. 
Alright, that's it for lesson 2. Thanks for watching and happy floor planning.